All right, here's my next steam engine. It's a mill engine. Built all the parts myself. Did all the castings and everything. These are the blowdown valves here. I always open those up when I first start the engine. You see that water coming out. You want to always do that. Now I'm going to turn on the steam. It's really cold out today, so I'm getting a lot of steam. So once you've got. Okay, it's got a two and three quarter bore, four inch stroke, 36 inches long, 20 inches wide. I'm just running it off of one of my 20 inch boilers, which is also available on eBay. Really nice whistle on that one, but this is sale is just for the engine. It's got an antique strip boiler on it. You just adjust these valves to about a quarter of a turn to supply enough uh, oil for the engine. A couple antique pulleys for the refurbished. So it's charging this DC battery right now. And that's only turning. It's only turning about 100 RPM right now. If I had a more stable cable, I'd be able to crank it up a little bit. But on the alternator, if you've got 200 RPM, 300 RPM on the engine, then you'd have about 1,000 RPM on the alternator. 14 inch V belt pulley right there. So, like I said, it's about 36 inches long, uh, 20 inches wide, 20 inches tall. And then uh, the exhaust here, you just want to run it up the stack to your boiler, go inside the stack. Once you plumb it in, I'll crank up the RPM a little bit more, but I don't, the table isn't very stable today. It's a brand new engine, so it's uh, just being broken in. I'll turn up the valve just a little bit more. It can easily go up to 375 RPM. Beautiful sound to it. Tough. oiler on top. It uh, has the uh, old style mill engine crop light guide. Very hard to machine. Very difficult. Crank disc is 7 inch diameter. There's an oiler there on it. It's eccentric. There are oilers on it as well. I've got a bolt coming out here because I wanted to adjust it a little bit. That's a really simple alternator, about mid-1970s alternator, Chevrolet GM. Uh, it's a single pole alternator. No charge battery. Battery bank, whatever you got. Beautiful engine. My name's Ross. If you're interested in this engine, it'll be on up for sale on eBay with the alternator and everything on it. My number is 206-948-0770. My email address is anacortesteam. That's A-N-A-C-O-R-T-E-S-S-T-E-A-M. All one word. Anacortesteam at gmail.com. Give me a call. Email me with any questions of both of these 
individually will be on eBay for sale. That's about it for now. Thanks for watching.